Hey, hey. Well, I'm using my 360 camera. I'm going to see how that goes. I've just got the frontal video playing, so you're not going to get the 3D effects. But I'm going to just see how it goes with the audio and obviously what it looks while I'm recording as well. Because we want to have a nice view, don't we? It's Sunday the 18th of February. I did a time lapse yesterday. I actually did a lot of talking yesterday, but as usual, I had massive issues with the audio and I could hardly work it out. So I cut out all the talking bits and the timeline that I've done, I've just chucked that on. So as much as a lot of people love the time lapse like myself, that's not good enough for somebody who's truck vlogging. course on eBay. Bitten's gone ballistic for it, so it's a gone. It'll be gone tomorrow, and hopefully, if this works, I'll carry on with this. If not, I'll just buy myself something else. Uh, the, one, the good thing is, very easy this one to control as well, and also when I want to jump in chuck it on the 360 or front and back view if you ever you want to see my ugly mug while I'm driving or while you can see the front it's it's got that capability as well I won't do that when I'm driving though but I can set it up when I've stopped and give you a little show so I'm double deckers today and tomorrow yesterday was a nice shift 11 hours lovely run and um, up here in the Tesco's, I was in Tesco's for nearly, well, probably about an hour and a half, not too bad, and then over the Bartlett's, uh, which is the nice potatoes, posh potatoes, potatoes, and it's a trail I swap there, and then down the west coast, back home, that was it, lovely run. The good thing is, it literally started almost. My shift started at 6:30, so it was almost getting light by the time I got out of the yard. And by the time I was on the A1, it was it was light, and I finished in the light. I can't believe it! it was brilliant. First one this year. stopped at that lay-by we just passed yesterday and I did a bit of video of the, the, the state of it and how bad it is um, oh, oh my god honestly horrific so I'll put that on on this vlog because I was holding the camera so you could hear it's all right but appalling absolutely appalling the condition I mean it's been bad for ages for months Lay-bys and I know there's cutbacks and that, and it, it shouldn't be up to them to, to clean it, and it's sad. But no one else is going to do it. It's, it's such a massive job. There's human crap on the side of the road and everything. It, would just, it takes a clean-up team. But they need to try and set something up, some kind of trap, you know, to catch these people out of doing it. Insane. Paul was saying that washing the services at the minute, and people in there spending the night, they're getting robbed, the, the diesel's getting stolen, and also the curtains. So, anybody who is watching this who's a truck errand and stop at Washington, just be advised. Uh, they, they got the warning, this is Pollock's got warnings not to stop there overnight. So, that says it all. Was it there just dropping a big in? Obviously, didn't agree with it. Loads around here, yeah. I love it. I'm going to get there at half past two, which is quite early. 
get empty, fuel up the double decker, and then we'll wait and see how long I've got to wait for my, my ride home basically. Whether it's ready or not, probably not. Right, that'll do for now. I'll have a little look at this when I stop because it's connected to my phone. So I'll be able to see if it's any good or not. So she's up the road. Right, I might East Lothian, I just want to show you this. This is the one after the river time, you've got like rubbish all the way up there. Coming along here into the lay by. I mean, like that, that wrap in this, you know, you can accept that in a way because it could have fell off or something, but I doubt it, you know. Just dis absolutely disgusting. And then, um, avert your eyes if you're not. If you're squeamish, that is human crap on the side of the road. I mean, look at the state of this. Oops! Absolutely disgusting, dirty bastards. Okay, let's check out and see what's there. Uh in here. Last week, I don't know if it was a Sunday, I think it was, there was a guy waiting to get on, but he let me jump in front because he was in no hurry. I've had a little look, uh, I stopped filming flask up and um, had a little playback, but it seems okay. Uh, the audio is absolutely spot on, perfect. Might be on a winner. You can see it might be a bit jumpy, but that might stabilise once I've rendered it. All the boring stuff that you don't want to hear. Yada yada yada. Oh, you can smell the hops. It's like a brewery here you know and you can half smell the hops not all the time though but today it's strong all right there's a double decker on Me. Just wait for that one to clear off and then it's my turn. It's 
me now on the A1, getting a bit dark, so I thought I'll have a little look and see what the quality's like in the dark. It ain't too bad at all, is it? on a winner yeah folks I'll get this little vlog up probably do it in the morning before I go to work or quite possibly tonight and I look forward to your reactions from it see if you're happy to go with this or not This is a good test, isn't it, to see how this one is with the the lights from the obviously the cars and also the street lights. See if you're getting that kind of glare that we were having issues with when I was driving through the night. A lot of people were complaining about it. Again, there wasn't a lot I could do with the settings. I could have bought filters and things, but we'll see what this is like. It's so it now, it's half past five. So it's getting there, it's getting dark. Everyone's got to have the lights on. when it's really dark uh, when I'm going through the street lights around the Newcastle area there's quite a lot around there that's the big test I'll let you have that one mate, have plenty of time See if you went now There, it looks picking the, picking the light up anyway, isn't it? It's looking quite good. Happy bunny. You see, I can't see what it's like when I'm driving past cars because I'm too busy driving. by public toilet. And the A1. And I, I'm, I'll probably, I'll say the whole of the A1 by the way. That's the only public toilet. From Scotland. Right in the four which is where the A1 ends in England. services good thing bad thing there should be more especially when you see how bad these laybys are don't want to stick one further up the road and you throw the end on there yeah me mile
watch the last 10 minutes of the Spurs game.